everyone's day is off to an amazing start thanks so much for stopping in today guys we're back at it as you can clearly see it's a mess around here but no worries we're gonna get it together so right now I am in what I like to call my overflow closet this is the closet off of the owner's suite I think that's what we're no primary suite is what everybody's calling it calling it these days um so right now we are in my overflow closet this is the closet I share it with Eric um this is that closet and this is my side and so what I'm doing is bringing the things that I want to keep over here so that I don't have to worry about getting paint on them once the painting starts um, but as you can see, it's a mess, but we're going to get it taken care of better safe than sorry, you know, put everything over here, not going to be doing any painting over here and, um, everything will just stay, you know, clean and paint free. So that's what we're doing today. Um, we will be heading to Goodwill. We have more items to take to Goodwill and um, I think I'm gonna go to Home Goods today to look for some decor pieces. I know that's a bit premature. I probably should get finished, uh, finished decluttering um, in my. Uh, One step forward, two steps backwards, yeah. Immature lover 
I decided to come back over here and see if I could do one more Goodwill bag before heading out. And here it is right here. As you can see though, all of the drawers are pretty much empty. I have all the drawers emptied out. So that's great. I took down the things that were hanging and quite a few of the items that were here will actually be going to Goodwill also over here. But I have this dress right here that I probably won't wear again, but I just can't bring myself to get rid of it. I purchased this dress from Pretty Little Things. Um, is it Things or Thing? Let's see, Pretty Little Thing. Some time ago, well, actually just a few years ago, this was the dress that I wore for Chase's graduation. Oh gosh, it has a little flutter sleeves, little flutter neck here. And um, it's really long and just really pretty. I got a lot of compliments on it the day that I wore it. And like I said, I will probably not ever wear this again, but I'm just not gonna get rid of it. This was his high school graduation that I'm speaking of. Um, but so yeah, I will tuck that away somewhere. This pile of items right here, I will be keeping. This pile right here will be packaged up into these two bags that will be going to Goodwill. But yeah, I just wanted to give you guys another quick overview of the closet before we head out. I will actually be switching out all of my hangers as well. I'll see if Eric wants these. These are hangers from Ikea. I loved them when I initially got them some many, many moons ago. But right now, I just think that they're so thick and heavy and just bulky. They take up so much space in the closet. So I'm not looking to use those in here anymore. And then also, I'm probably going to get white because the closet's gonna be white. And then I think on another day, I will tackle this area of the closet. I have some plans for this little space right here. We took the doors off of the closet when we decided to do this room. And I love it. I think it just really opens up um, this little room. So not gonna put the doors back on, but I am gonna do something I think that's really going to enhance the look of the space. So up here is an Ikea unit. That's gonna come out. And then this is an Ikea unit as well. That's gonna come out also. So yeah, another day, gonna tackle that portion and get that out of here. But yeah, I'm ready to get dressed and head out. I've been in here. You, you guys will only see a bit of what I've been in here doing, but I'm quite over the packing up and giving to Goodwill stage. Oh yeah, all of that is going to go also. That will all be Goodwill as well. These items up here on top. Yeah, all that's going to go. I am oiling up and doing the last little minor adjustments before I head out. I feel like I, did I say this already? I feel like I am living out of trash bags right now because everything in my closet has been moved around and disrupted. Uh, the dress that I'm wearing a dress today, the dress that I'm wearing, thank goodness it has saved my life. I purchased it from Amazon and I cannot wait to share with you guys how it looks. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna wear it today though. We're just, getting, we're just getting ready to go to Home Goods if I haven't said that. And I feel like it is slightly extra to go to Home Goods. As you can see, it has like the tank shoulders and whatnot. So that's not the problem. Uh, but I'll stand up here in a second and share it with you. Today's body butter uh, is scandalous. Oh, it smells so freaking amazing. This is from, this is the Victoria's Secret Scandalous. If you've ever smelled it, that's what this is. Um, shout out to those of you who um, used the code that I mentioned in the last video that we shall not name. Um, shout out to those of you who watched the video and used the code to shop in the store. Thank you guys so very much. Today is Sunday. And those, video, those videos, those orders will be headed out on tomorrow, right? So those of you who shot the last couple of days, those orders go out tomorrow. You guys know I have what, like a seven, 10 day processing time. Very, very, very rarely will I use all of that processing time to ship my orders out. 
orders come in and orders go out around here. So just want to thank you guys for your continued business in the store. And yeah, that is today's body butter fragrance of today. Again, that was scandalous. That code, I said I was going to uh, end it after a few hours after the video went live, but because you guys, you guys have just been so, so very sweet in the comments regarding, you know, what happened to my family and also all of the personal emails that you guys have sent over our way. Um, you guys are just so simply just, not even simply, just amazingly amazing and we appreciate you all so very much. Um, if I have not had an opportunity to respond to your emails and um, comments, guys, I see them and um, they are greatly, greatly appreciated. I thank you guys so, so, so very much. And two of you actually met Eric. He was going for a walk around here in the neighborhood and uh, it was you, your, it was a young lady and her husband. He said you guys were in an amazing red cor Corvette. I was out doing whatever and he called me and said this couple just pulled up and said hello that they watched the channel and they were in just an amazing um, red Corvette. So hello, hi. Thanks for saying hello to Eric <laughs> as he was doing his walk. But yeah, getting ready to head out uh, to Home Goods and want to share with you guys what I was wearing today. I haven't narrowed down the purse for today. Um, just this dress. This dress is actually the only thing that I could really get my hands on that did, didn't need ironing. Um, and it's courtesy of Amazon, of course, not courtesy that they sent it to me, courtesy of I ordered it from Amazon. And here's the gag, right? I had purchased this dress a couple of weeks ago, but put it in the Goodwill pile. So someone at Goodwill has a brand new dress. Yeah, but it's a good dress, so I had to order it again. Uh, but anywho, I hope that you can see, you know how the lighting is here in my office. Also, disregard what you are seeing back that way. We will be getting a new TV here shortly. And so that's just some of the tech stuff that will be going along with the TV. But guys, get into this dress absolutely love it it is for sure a dupe for the kim kardashian skims i love it it is so smooth now you will have to be sure that your undergarments are on point because it's not very forgiving the fabric is great um but if you need to be smoothed out a little bit you need to make sure that you are you know wearing the appropriate undergarments but i love it so today I'm wearing it here with my black patent Tory Burch Millers. Love these, but as you can also see, um, the dress is super long. So if you wanted to elevate the dress a little bit more, um, both in terms of, I guess, height, getting it off of the floor, but also in terms of dressing it up a bit, you could wear it with, you know, some heels. But as I look at it, guys, I don't know. I'm trying to decide if I actually do want to wear this out of the house. I'm just going to Home Goods. This might be a bit much for Home Goods. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think Every, it's too much. You don't think it's too much? Uh, in um, Atlanta, that's, the, that's, the girls in Atlanta. You might as well be Amish. You're right. Oh, no, and that's, that's, <laughs> see if I can brighten it up some. Yeah, the girls here in Atlanta leave see, the house to go to Kroger and everybody. they just give all the things. So why <laughs> should I be conservative today? I don't know, but I love it. Um, I'll have it linked below if anybody is interested. I have it in black. I've also ordered it again in black and I have, I believe, two other colors.
Eric and I are getting ready to head out. We're going to pick up a new TV for the theater room upstairs. No, we just picked up a new TV for the theater room upstairs. We're going today to get a TV for the family room. Working on so many rooms at the same time, my head is spinning. So I'm going to bring you guys along for that. What I'm doing right now is switching into another purse. This is the purse, of course, that I've been wearing, my Gucci Messenger, but on yesterday, I had this um, Adidas little fanny pack. Shout out to the young lady I saw yesterday in West Elm um, down at Ponce City Market. Thank you so much for saying hello. I didn't get your name, so please forgive me, but it was really nice meeting you. Um, on yesterday, we were just down there kind of hanging out, walking around on the belt line. We grabbed a bite to eat. We didn't stay down there long because you guys know it is so, it's just so, so hot. So this is what I had on yesterday and just some workout clothes. So today I am going to switch from this bag that I've really been wearing. I got to get another messenger um, because this one and this one. They're tired of me, I know. This is the one that I'm going to switch into today to kind of give this one a break. And yeah, I think that's everything that I want out of there. Um, put my driver's license and everything back in here. So yeah, uh, we're working on the theater room and my closet pretty much at the same time. I'll take you guys upstairs and show you the progress. Well, there really isn't any progress in the theater room, just the new TV. So we'll go upstairs and take a look, look at that. With me standing. The fragrance that I put on just now for the body butter was actually pineapple and it smells amazing. It does, it smells amazing. I feel like I should be on a beach somewhere instead of getting ready to go to Best Buy. But anywho's, these are the Sunnies, like I said, that I picked up from or that I ordered from Amazon. They're almost frameless. It's like there's a frame, like gold frame at the bottom, but nothing at the top. Love these. All right. Bodysuit, again, it's like a t-shirt bodysuit from Target. Target and their tees, tanks, absolutely love. The jeans, super old Nordstrom. When I purchased these originally, there was not this much distressing on them, but I love the way that they have aged. Uh, the shoes are my Tory Burch trainers. This was my first pair, love these. As you can see, they are absolutely holding up beautifully. And then my Gucci Messenger. This one is so old. I'll never get rid of this one. Absolutely love it. Um, so that's the look for today. <laughs> All right, guys, that's the TV that's currently up there that's getting ready to be replaced. Side note, don't y'all clock my flowers right here, okay? I'm gonna get my life together. Those flowers will be replaced, but when I tell you those flowers have been up there for at least a whole season, I'm gonna replace them, guys. Just, just, just bear with me here. Um, just bear with me. Um, so yeah, that's the TV right there. It's small. It's going to be replaced. This is the TV that was upstairs. Eric, this is what, a 75 inch? That's about 72. Oh, really? Yeah, it oh. looks bigger than it, it is. It looks, yeah. That's an old TV too. You know, TV technology changes so fast. That TV's Can you guys see? It? It's really old. thin though. So. Yeah, but anyway, so that's the TV that was upstairs and now we'll head upstairs and I'll share with you the TV that's, the new TV that's upstairs it's in the theater the room. Same. And I think we're gonna get the exact TV, right? Yeah. To go here. All right, so hold the line, please. Hope that you guys can get a sense of the size of this one. Disregard whatever you may see. This room also is in transition, much like my closet. All of that is going to come down, but yeah, this is the new TV. Eric, this one up here is what size? 75. This one's 75, the one downstairs is what? 70. 70? Huh, okay. 
it didn't look as big on camera as it does in person it's a good size though so we were just talking about tvs all the work surrounding getting a tv these days and just electronics in general tired, it's like all um, our electronics decided to buy <laughs> once your macbook by the way i got beef your two thousand dollar macbook lasted four years mm -hmm. like all these apple people that love apple i just i, don't I am an apple person eric loves what is yours like window you love yeah, windows I, like PCs. PCs. I mean i don't mind apple i just mm -hmm. don't get the hype mm -hmm. i don't get the hype to me it's not that much better and again your two thousand dollar plus macbook lasted four years i mean i guess we could have got it fixed but it just would have broke again i have no complaints with the that thing is trash apple no, electronics no apple makes great um, the, the iphone mm -hmm. tablet ecosystem is great all the iphone stuff is fine i don't get the hype with the laptops i don't get it because it you don't you you've never used i one. use them you when i got yours i got your old one i use it at work I use it sometimes. It's all right. Sometimes, Ari. For your job, you know you are. What is that big bulky thing that you use anyway? What is I mean, that? That's have, a PC. We, we have. We can pick Windows or Mac, and I always pick Windows. Right. So Eric's laptop is this thick, and you know but but the that's what Apple, Apple laptop people. is just super thin. All the Apple people, y'all get sold on the aesthetics. It's mm -hmm. like, oh, the Apples look all sexy and they thin do. and silver. They but who do. cares? And they're faster, in my opinion. They're you can faster. Get a fast Windows. Well, so currently, guys, I have a fast Windows now. So I don't. I'm not apple laptop girl anymore um it really breaks my heart to say that i currently have a what is it what what is it? it's like a gaming laptop i got you a gaming laptop yeah because it's, it's faster yeah um, and then my beef with the tvs well now when you buy anything electronic mm -hmm. but especially like televisions or, or internet connected devices like you got to do all the setup it's like you got to buy a tv then you got to download the software for the TV. That's right, because they're smart the TVs. Netflix and Hulu yeah. and, and whatever. It's like, it takes you, no lie, one of the TVs we put in, I think it took me probably an hour after I mounted it to set mm -hmm. it up, just to log into all the software and download the updates. And oh my God, it's like, man, it, I, it's a first world problem. But these electronics now, they're almost too smart. I just, I, it's, it's a lot of work. Where are your scissors? Yeah, okay. Because it, it won't fit with the box. Yeah. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. Uh, so it will be blocking the. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you want to lay it flat or? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I would say, can you bend the seats a little bit, like to the front? To the front. And then kind of just give it like a slant. Okay. Slant. All right, guys, so we are back with the TV. This is it right here. As you guys saw, there was a little bit of an ordeal getting it into the truck, but we got it in there and you can kind of see the size difference. So current TV and if I come down, you will see that the new TV is actually going to take up the whole space. Wouldn't you say, babe? That looks like it's going to take up just about yeah, that entire. Sorry, space. Um, you know what? So now I won't have to uh, fill in that vase, but I'll put it somewhere else. Um, but I, I don't, yeah, I just I don't. don't. That potpourri. That's potpourri now. <laughs> right, right. But yeah, I don't think there's going to be room up there for anything else. And we have the plastic still on it. Um, so someone's coming on Monday, Monday. to put it up there. Eric, is he going to have a team or somebody? It's too okay. It's too yeah, I don't think he's going to lift that by himself. And we're getting a new receiver for it as well. So, yeah, that's the new TV. So, this is the new laptop, guys. This is a gaming laptop. And now, here comes Eric. I do love the colors. Look at the rainbow keyboard. Look at that, y'all. Come on. <laughs> I do love the colors on it. Um, it's really nice. Fast processor. A terabyte of uh, storage. 16 gig of RAM. Mm -hmm. Half the price of a, uh, of a MacBook. Yeah. But actually, you know what? The MacBooks you would want would probably be $2,500. So, mm -hmm. so this is like... But this is what I said earlier, guys. For me, isn't a laptop supposed to cost at least $2,000? Um, yeah. 
I, I don't you have can a get problem. A good laptop. If you're just doing it, surfing the internet and using Word and stuff, mm -hmm. $500, $400. But yeah. I'm not just surfing the internet. Well, yeah, you're doing video editing, yeah. so you got something more up to date. That's mm -hmm. why. I, that's why you get a gaming laptop. New mm -hmm. TV and all of its components are in place. Not sure if you guys can really tell the difference in the size, but listen, those of us who live here understand that this TV here has made a world of difference here in the family room downstairs. Oh my gosh, it just looks, oh, I just love it. <laughs> this TV compared to what we had up here before, oh my gosh, it's huge. It is huge. Listen, I know some of you probably are like, what, my TV takes up the entire wall. Oh gosh, you're blessed. <laughs> Ours takes up this fireplace area and we're just really happy with it. The guys did a great job installing it. This is actually how it looks from the kitchen area. Um, again, it's a mess. Disregard anything that you see. We have to get up all of the stuff that they kind of left. Um, they're the items over there that um, were on top of the fireplace. I won't be using those um, over on the fireplace anymore. Um, I think I'm going to find a home for these items over in my office. Guys, that office is still a work in progress in terms of the bookshelves. The bookshelves over there still are not complete. I'm sure some of, some of you in the videos can probably tell that behind me, there are some shelves, you know, when I film in there that are not, you know, done yet but um so yeah i think i'm gonna put some of those items over there if i can i'll have to try it out just you know just to see if i like it um but i think i'll do that in the next video i'm gonna go ahead and wrap this video up here the video is really i've been editing the video bit by bit piece by piece as i get get the clips and it's taking me a long time because like i said i don't have an apple computer anymore so it's really taking me a long time to edit the videos i mean it's it's exhausting i am T.I. Red, all right? Um, but before I, want to go, before I go, I want to share this show with you guys. Are you guys watching Jury Duty? If you have not started watching Jury Duty, do yourself a favor, go check it out. It is hilarious. And I wanna say this is what, is this Netflix? I think this is Netflix. Netflix or Prime, I don't know, one of them. Um, but it's really funny. Um, but yeah, I think that's gonna do it for today's video. Guys, I need to clean up. Um, I think tomorrow I am actually going to go and get a pedicure, just kind of treat myself. I just feel like I've just been looking out of it the last, what, few videos. So I just gotta get it together, reel it back in, get back to myself. Um, but yeah, but really appreciate you all, you you guys. Really appreciate you guys stopping in. Thank you so much again for all of the love and support. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye guys. You can keep your bitter.